My name is Greg Valcanti, and I'm the director of our University of Florida Center for Autism and Related Disabilities, the CARD Center here at Gainesville. And my background is in education, specifically special education. I started out as a teacher of students with special needs in Virginia, and following that was an administrator in the school system and came to the University of Florida for my graduate studies. And after receiving my PhD, I took a position here at the University of Florida Psychiatry Department, working with children in the hospital at first, and later um, receiving grants and working in the community more and more. And for the past 27 years, um, been the director of our Card Center here and was one of the founding members of this center. We're expecting that uh, educators and others can benefit from this program in many ways. And we feel that the uh, skills that will be taught through the four course sequence will benefit people in the classroom uh, at elementary levels and secondary levels. We think that um, we've got a good handle on, on the skills that teachers need. All of our instructors um, have experience in school settings and in education and uh, years and years of experience working with children uh, and uh, students who have autism spectrum disorders. Well, for example, uh, in the course that I teach, which is uh, autism spectrum across the lifespan, there's a, a lot of emphasis on the social skills that um, students need to learn in schools uh, and the transition skills that students need to learn to be able to grow to successful adults. Well, one of our courses, our introductory course, has a great emphasis on uh, identification of autism spectrum disorders. And so I, I think that teachers taking our sequence will be well prepared to help their teams identify students who are in need of further evaluation and diagnosis for an autism spectrum disorder. We know from research that early interventions are crucial, not just important, but crucial for students to get a good start, to be able to overcome some of the difficulties that come with an autism spectrum disorder, to be able to learn and use the social interaction and the communication skills that are vital for progress in life and progress uh, in an education curriculum. So uh, we strongly believe that early intervention is an important part of anyone's repertoire who wants to work with folks on the autism spectrum. And um, we feel we've got a program that will help prepare people uh, in a, a very professional way. Yes. If you're interested in uh, working with students who have autism and keeping them in general education, keeping them included in society and life as much as possible, uh, you're, uh, you've come to the right place. Uh, all of our instructors, all of our faculty here have uh, dedication and experience with promoting inclusive practices for students on the autism spectrum. It's part of uh, the CARD way of life that we try to promote um, a successful school and community inclusion. And so modules in all of our courses have some emphasis on the importance of including students with autism spectrum disorder with students who are typically developing in the general education classes.
Our College of Medicine here is full of doctors and uh, other health professionals, but our faculty for the courses uh, in our Autism Spectrum Disorder Graduate Certificate Program are all people with an education background and a psychology background who have worked in a variety of uh, settings, including schools, including hospitals, including uh, community settings and agencies. So one of the great assets of our program is that we have a faculty who have a broad range of experience and who are supported through the College of Medicine in our endeavors here uh, in the autism programs that we have. We do have a course in the neurobiology of autism spectrum disorders, and um, it's a very fascinating course. It's um, accessible, though, to folks who do not have a science background, a medical background, or uh, a health sciences background. It's accessible to educators, to families, um, and I think you know, teachers who take the course will be glad they did and be uh, happy that they're able to learn some of the neurobiological basis for what we understand as autism spectrum disorder. But we have a strong focus on working with families and understanding the development of individuals with autism spectrum disorder from early childhood through adolescence um, and preparing them for adulthood. So well, I think that it can be very valuable for teachers uh, at the elementary level um, as well as for teachers at the secondary level. We have a strong emphasis in my course on the skills needed to teach transitioning for uh, secondary students and to prepare them for adult life. We strongly believe that anyone can benefit from taking the graduate certificate courses that we have here in our program. And uh, so for my course in particular, I think that it's very valuable for teachers um, at all levels. As I mentioned, there's a strong emphasis on transition skills, transition programs, and preparing students for life after secondary school, whether that be through employment, through higher education, through independent living in the community. Uh, all of those skills are things we want our young folks with autism to gain as they go through school. And we've learned from working with children through many, many years that all children grow up. We've had people from a variety of different backgrounds and they've all been very happy uh, and felt like they've learned a lot. We feel that um, those uh, in, who teach general education classes, teachers of kindergarten classes or fourth grade classes or high school math or middle school art, that they all are likely to encounter students with autism spectrum disorder at some point if they haven't already. And so we feel it's important for them to have a good background in autism spectrum disorders and the skills needed to help those students be successful. And we feel like all those people will benefit from our course sequence here.